Uh, obviously, it was good to go out and get a win. And, uh, you know, it was good to get a bunch of guys in the football game, obviously. Got a chance to get a bunch of different guys that haven't got a chance to play in a while. Get those guys some experience. Uh, we talked to the team there at halftime, and we told some guys that were going to get an opportunity to get in the game and kind of show us what they can do. And I think as we continue to progress forward, we'd like to uh, keep encouraging these guys when they get the opportunity to come in the game that uh, they're you know, they're expected to play at a high level and got some corrections, got to get scored away there. But uh, overall, it was a good effort. And, uh, I was concerned probably coming into the game a little bit that we might come out flat and not be ready to play. But uh, we did come out ready to play, and that's encouraging. And, uh, you know, it's a win. And uh, we'll move forward. We've got Western Illinois here in town next week. And uh, we'll be coming in. they got a late game here tonight against Missouri State. And see how the conference shakes out. Coach, you were worried about earlier in the week about the plus one with their uh, with their defensive scheme, and it seemed like uh, at least as far as the running game was concerned, that didn't bother you too much. If they got on the field. You know, uh, they were a plus one team, and uh, you know, if you look at I think some of the statistics, you know, if you're just looking at that, you know, you'd say that wasn't a concern. Probably the only glaring thing I was probably concerned about was is our ability on uh, short yardage there to get some first downs, and uh, you know, they were plus one, hit a couple of gaps. And, we missed a couple things here and there, but uh, overall it was a good day. Uh, Jermaine Cook's obviously a good running back, he continues to show that. And then we put Bellamy in there, it was a nice change up for us. And the guys got a chance to see Jordan Thompson, he hasn't been around in a while. Uh, he had a shoulder injury earlier in the year, and he's back at full strength. And in order for us to make this run here the next month, uh, we're going to need all those guys healthy so we can uh, continue to run the football. Um. Coach, what were you most pleased with today in the game? Uh, you know, I was excited to see Jordan Thompson obviously get in there and do some good things. It's always good to get Bellamy some experience. Uh, we put Eric Franklin in there quite, quite you know, early in the football game. Uh, he's a guy that hadn't had a chance to play a lot. It was good for us to get him some experience. And then we also got uh, Conlon in there at center. You're always concerned about when you have to go to a backup center, whether you're going to be able to continue to play at a high level. It was good to see him. Another true freshman in there playing, so that was encouraging. Uh, defensively, we uh, got a couple more freshmen in there. We gave uh, Bam some snaps there, some Sam linebacker. Got Ali back in the mix, get some rest off him. Had John Sasson in there in the middle uh, for the second half. So kind of get those guys back in the flow, uh, you know, so if we ever have an injury, we don't uh, have any drop off. Coach, do you like these games, or are you happy to get back in the conference? You know what? Uh, you know, I mean, your schedule's a schedule. Uh, I think the only thing you probably get concerned about is, is uh, you know, I, I will always worry that our team or any team really looks at another team and uh, sees their record and, and may have a preconceived thought that, uh, you know, you just chalk it up as a win. And I, I don't think you can do that in this day and age of college football. They do a good job. They play hard. They make a conscious effort to run the football. They have good schemes, and uh, it doesn't really matter really who you play. You have to come ready to play, and uh, we see upsets all the time. And uh, you know that's the thing that does concern you. But uh, you know we uh, got a win here today, and we're gonna move forward. Coach, you have to with a fast start and the consistency you saw in the first half. First off, I was excited about that. I was look, you know. Uh, <clears throat> I was encouraged by the fact that we were able to do some things there, uh, running the ball, especially in the first half with the plus one situation. We were able to throw the ball pretty well. I uh, didn't really have a lot of pressure on the quarterback. Those are good signs. And I thought we did some good things uh, defensively. You know, really the only glaring thing was is we had an abundance of penalties today, uh, two offsides there. I thought that they were moving the football, but uh, we'll see that on video, so we'll get a, a ruling on that later. And then, uh, you know, they called us for uh, a late hit there, or a personal foul there on the quarterback, and, you know, we were really just trying to avoid a head-to-head -head contact and uh, ended up hitting the guy up underneath the chin, which was not deliberate. We were actually trying to lower our head and get away from being a head-to-head -head contact, so we were trying to do the right thing and uh, got a flag there, so that was discouraging. But, uh, you know, hey, uh, it's a learning process for us, and we continue to strive on just improving, getting better every week, and putting things behind us, learning from it, and getting ready to play the next ball game.